Hello. Oh, there we go. Hold up. Testing, testing. Yeah, there we go. Okay. The microphone was not working for some reason. Or it wasn't being picked up at all on the thing here. Anyways, uh, let's get on with it. Enough waiting. Enough technical problems. We'll be on the game now. Trying to see what we got left on the electromancer. Still got a couple more skills. Sorry, one last tree section, but we need more levels first. <clears throat> Alright. Let me see my stone shard. Uh, patch notes, any patch notes. Well, there was one yesterday. Fixed a lot of things supposedly, but some things I didn't even know that were broken either. That's how it is, I guess. Uh, continue. Uh, let's see. We left off on Bryn. What was I doing here? Oh, yeah, we got an artifact, yes, or on Friday. That's right, I have fatigue. I don't think I have any jobs available right now. Nope. Uh, Osbrook, Manshire, I still need to do a lot of... Okay. Wait, what the heck? Why did I only get 200 rep? What the heck? That's where I keep getting 250 here. Oh no, oh, they nerfed one of them. What? I nerfed some of the- oh no, this is match here, whoops. <laughs> I got the wrong one. There we go, I was like, why is it random? 250, 200. There we go, this is the one I'm supposed to look at. Okay, there we go, 250, 250. I need two more quests. Um, what's on the floor? Alt. Actually, what's- I forgot I left this here. I have a shit ton of money in the bank. Let me do my backpack. No. Let me go to the bank actually. While I'm here, <clears throat> might as well leave some things. <clears throat> oh yeah. I think this thing is up in 24 hours. I think. Pretty sure it is. Yeah, it's up in 24 hours. Just the bankers aren't there, but. This thing is okay. The money's just gonna be in there. I'm gonna leave my weapon in here. Um, uh, where is it? Anything else I want to put away? Oh, yeah, more money. I have too much on me again. There we go. Until I get to 5,000, I'm not gonna be able to buy anything new. All right, that's all I want to put away. Just my exquisite pull mace. I probably not gonna use it. It's, it would be good, but I'm not meleeing a lot, so that's not a good idea. Not to go in melee range. Alright, um. Let's go sleep off the night. Hopefully, there's a job by the time I wake up. It has my equipment doing. Status fine. I think armor's fine. Crowbars. Do they need repairing? This. Oh my gosh, that one needs repairing. <laughs> it's done a one. One condition out of ten. All right, I'll repair in the morning. <clears throat> okay, we're finally gonna make it. All right, I saw saw some big people or big. Saw one big streamer streaming the game yesterday, and then I saw uh, kind of a big YouTuber kind of playing uh, Stone Shard. I saw his video. I think it's Splatter Cat Gaming. That's the one. That's where I found, actually. That's where I found out about this game. I found it from him. So he always plays a bunch of indie games that I wouldn't heard about. <laughs> so you know, I gave it a try and I bought it. Because of him. I saw he put a new video out about how it is currently and with the new update and all that. It's the last time he played it because yeah, it's been a while since he played it. 
And they added a good amount. Oh yeah, I forgot to buy the room. A lot of stuff. Uh, I feel like we won't see an update maybe till fall. Yeah, we're not going to see another stone shard update till fall probably. Here's hoping. I'm not sure. You know. It could or could not be. Because they they've been working on this one for a while, so. We will see. Actually, uh, I need it to be day for now, so. Let me just make it morning real quick and then sleep the next day off. Oh, but my fatigue's gone, isn't it? Fuck, hold up. Oh, no, it's still there. Okay. <clears throat> I think I just lost the ability to sleep till one now. I just need to repair some stuff. Yes, I was saying, uh, so some... The heck? Why is it looking... That was weird. They haven't really looked my inventory in a long time, unless they patched it out. Because he hasn't done that in a... ever since the patch came out. I hasn't looked at my inventory for stolen goods. I think that might, they, might, they might have been bugged then. <laughs> Because, uh, yeah, I wasn't expecting him to search me. They didn't do that anymore, it seemed. Whatever. Uh, I guess it's working again as it was. Just hopefully it's not as annoying. Where they're constantly searching. Um, uh, anything else I needed? I got my medication. Um... Bandages, and you put these away. Wait, wait, what the heck did they do to these? Oh, they, they show you the negatives now, okay. Whoa, there's a lot of... This is a lot of downsides now to drinking potions. I mean, it was already bad enough getting 20 intoxication straight up. <clears throat> Let's see, 25 times 6. Uh, that's actually, that's a good amount. Cause it's point twenty five. It's four for one. Uh, I'm gonna fuck my maps off right now. How much is uh? Let's see. Fuck, I don't know. Let <laughs> me get a calculator. I can't think of it at the top of my head. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, where's my calculator? How much increases uh? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Calculator. Alright, um... 0 0.25 times 60. That's 15 more intoxication. That's 35%, basically. It's just they skimmed it over a couple turns now. Yeah, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> yeah, it yeah, seems your math skills are better than mine, for sure. That's 35% intoxication, then. That's kind of a lot for one potion. Especially when you're, if you're in a boss fight, you have to chug more than one of those damn things. That's going to be way too much intoxication. I don't know how I'm going to handle that in the boss fight. I mean, I know this helps, but you do not want to consume this because it's going to confuse you. Wait, what the heck? Did this always give negative 5 health replenishment? I don't remember Antidote giving negatives at all, other than confusion. I think they added that, yeah. Antidote never had that. Okay. Now it has two downsides, but I guess the confusion is more of a bad thing. Alright, um. We have to keep the mask on us so then it, it'll work if we die. It'll res us. I don't know how it works. Actually, I'm curious. I've never. I've never used this mask in actual combat. I've never had it work since I've never died with it. Does it like actually resurrect me or does it like... Uh, whatchamacallit. <clears throat> Just stop me from dying at that one percentage and then it heals me all the way after that. I'm just curious, I don't think about it. Alright, so technically each potion is like 35% after 60 turns of intoxication. Jeez, just drinking two already is pushing it. Jeez, that's gonna be 70% for two potions after 60 turns. 
I don't know how you're gonna handle that. Anything else that reduces intoxication? You eat like a good amount other than antidote? And it doesn't have a bad side effect like confusion? I can't- I know and oh, antitoxin, but there's also the negative of hunger with that, which is a bit more manageable. I remember now. Um, hmm. Yeah, I guess it had to be antitoxin. I had to bring a bunch of them too, and then I'd be hungry and thirsty really fast. Huh. Interesting. Alright, let's see if this guy has a job now. I need rep for this place badly. <coughs> um, any rumors, mister? Nope. Alright, that reminds me. Let me just uh, drop some of these. Hypercy. Pain killing. These I don't need either. <coughs> Although, before I go, let me get the church buff. I don't know if the head priest ever goes to sleep or not. We'll find out. I hope he doesn't leave his spot. I've never gone to his church in the night. Or in the early morning. Oh, let's see, let's see. All my junk weapons on the floor. There he is. Okay, he never goes to sleep. <laughs> yes, he just doesn't. He's not human. He's some kind of... Uh... Monster. Never needs sleep. <clears throat> yeah, because if I don't see the villagers out here, oh, oh yeah, they're not here. That means uh, it's not early enough for them to wake up, and they're still sleeping. So something is wrong with that guy. I guess the host buff gives them never needing to sleep, no, and unlimited fatigue resistance, basically. <laughs> I guess that's what it is, you know, chalk it up to that. Thanks for the host buff. He never needs to sleep. Oh, this guy's still sleeping. Damn it, I need food. Oh no, I can't even tell what time it is. I know they wake up like at 7 and start the shop, but I don't know. Fuck, where am I gonna get food? At this hour. Maybe this guy's open? I have a lot of money, might as well. I got the... The rich money money. Yeah, here we go. He's open. Um, what's this? Dried fig. Was this always in the game? I don't remember. Uncooked fish. This cheese went rotten. How much for the normal cheese? 18? 18% for 8? That, that makes sense. This costs 18 and it gives... 18 hunger resistance, or hunger back. That's not a bad pricing, I guess. Um, this cheese, though, on the other hand, is another story. Goat cheese is different. Um, what's the cheapest dish? 53, 59. Oh, there we go, 41. I'll buy that, and then we're good. Let's go do a dungeon real quick. Let me drop some unnecessary things too. The more room, the better. Unnecessary, unnecessary. This is unnecessary. I'll keep that for just in case. All right. Do I have enough water? I have enough water. I think, oh no, I thought this was a soup. It's a animal vegetable thing. Uh, this still gives energy resistance, or restoration, I mean, this is good. Not much hunger, but a lot of random other stuff, so I guess it's fine. I pay what I get for, I guess. <laughs> I like for the cheapest food, and this is what I get. Low stats, basically. Ah. Oops. I accidentally up my mouse system too. Alright, what did I have on me? Let's see, I have a bunch of these spells. Uh, let me check my electromancy. Oh yeah, we learned these two, that's alright. We're basically almost done. Uh, I need two more points and I'm done with the electromancy. 
I don't know if I'll finish Magic Master or not. Uh, what level am I? 17, my gosh. Look how far I have to go just to get the next tier of loot or upgrades for my gear. Because I have to grind a shit ton of Brin quests. Thanks to them not showing up anymore in tier 1. Like, that's what I don't like. I don't like that they made the mage gear tier. Or actually, I don't even know if it's tier 2. I think about it. Because we're about to reach tier 2 rep, but I'm not sure if he's going to have it or not at tier 2. Alright, I'm trying to remember my spells here. My lightning ball, my ball of lightning. Oh gosh, there's two of them. Did they give him any moves? Nope, they still don't have any moves. Alright, chain of light action. It's this. This guy's in my way. Yeah, that's a close range. I gotta, I gotta use this spell. I forget. I haven't played in a couple days and I already forgot how to play this cool. Got a mid max. There. Dead. Good as dead. All right, we're going in a monastery. Ah, oh, shit, we're going in a monastery. Fuck. I remember this now. <laughs> Maybe I should have brought the pain killing potion. This is not going to play out well if it's a bad boss. Or if it's one of the new ones, I should say. I have not fought the leech one yet. Supposedly they nerfed the the tentacle dude kind of supposedly We'll find out though if it is him or not I haven't encountered him yet, so we'll find out After the patch update of Fixing some of these bosses. How much is this? Not much. Okay, someone's catching up to me too. Uh, fuck, there's so many of these guys on, uh, what? Why did I hit that? Oh no, I don't think I have anything. I'm just gonna break the net. Ah, oh, jeez. My <laughs> normal defenses are crap. <clears throat> there, oh my gosh, this guy's making me bleed. Two net trapper guys, oh my gosh. What is this? What crazy stuff is this? Actually, uh, what dungeon did I go to last time? Okay, I went to... I went to the fort. And I went to that one over there, and then here's the other hero's mausoleum. So I'm still missing one more hidden dungeon to do. I'll leave this, trash that. Is this dungeon not that big? Let's see if it is or not. Oh, we got one of these guys. Get rid of this altar dude. Thank goodness for ball lightning. Ah shoot, more enemies. Can I ball lightning? Oh, I can. There, I got just about everything in there, I hope. Whoa, that's one of those new enemies. He's bleeding already, what the heck? How did, how's he bleeding? Did I break something? Huh. Can I like oh I can chain lightning. Oh he got healed because of his teammate there. There he's dead, he's no longer a problem. What's this? Daggers too. Nice. Good stuff. I got a shiv, that's garbage. Just 
the bat. Who cares about that thing? Get rid of that. I'll take this just in case I bleed again. Oh, I wasn't expecting him as well. Alright, get rid of him. And I hit the structure somehow. And the four just went through. Ooh, a gold nugget. I don't think that's worth much actually. Surprisingly, I don't know why this nugget's not worth much. Another little cult system in here. Thinks he's got what it takes to kill me. Nope. Blue dagger, why not? I'll take it. Can I just shout at you? Open the door for me. Okay, you can. I hate it when enemies just stand at the door when you shout at them. I haven't seen it happen in a while, but it's happened before. That's why I don't want to shout too much at them at the door to get their attention. Right now my weakness is close range combat. Oh, I'll take that. Uh, nothing. All right, clearly I went the wrong way. Uh, where? Oh, where? Oh, saw somebody. All right. Things should be fine. Till I reach the boss. And the dead end. Money, nice. I'm even more rich now. Just making money per run. Uh, this one. Always check for traps. Always gotta check for them, man. Never know when there's this random ass trap just lying there. Alright, here's the boss. What kind of boss are you, though? That's the question. Good riddance. I still don't see him or her. Could be either one. Oh, thank goodness it's you. Thank goodness. I could just probably ball lightning, right? Yeah, oh, I didn't even realize he had a minion there. Oh, there's two minions. Oh, jeez. I can handle this. Um, since I'm in the power thing, I can just... Oh, he already died. What the hell was that? I got hurt. I can't reach that. Oh, I'm standing on this stupid sigil of his. Fuck, am I dying to that stupid sigil? Does he have any range spells on me? Jesus Christ, that stupid thing hurts. <laughs> the freaking sigil hurt a lot. Let's follow lightning him. Oh, no, wrong one, wrong one. Jeez, man, those sigils, I swear. I was not expecting to take damage, damage from that thing. I guess now I know not to stand in there for too long. Okay. Nice to know now. I never knew since I never stood in it long before either. Or I try not to in general. But I needed to stay on that one sigil of mine in order to get the buff. Oh, this is a letdown. Nothing... Nothing great, I'm done here. Actually, it's probably a good thing it's a left down. Um, I do not want to fight one of those new bosses. Well, that's a good thing, actually. Let's get out of here. No monastery dungeons for me. No, sir. Actually, hold up. <sighs> Thank you.
All right. Uh, hey, how? It's no. Uh, show show the head in inventory. Um, let's see. They nerfed the new monastery bosses, so it's fine now. Oh, I don't know how much they nerfed them though, so I haven't bought one yet. Suppo I saw some of the notes on it. The tentacle one supposedly gets cooldown on his tentacles now. Before it was just OP every time he spawned a new one. I mean, oh yeah, let me show you the head. Um, Wazzy. Uh, uh, we got Eknarch's Funeral Mask. Once per day, negate lethal damage and also replenish 20% max health and 35% energy. I mean, once per day though. Actually, that's still OP. Because technically... <laughs> We have two lives every day. That's kind of pretty good. Though, it's it just comes in clutch. I've never used it before. At all in my runs, but... It's there just in case. And like I said, it'd be, it'd be really good in permadeath, but we're not permadeath right now. Because the new content is a bit more harder. And I don't know about doing permadeath right now until they uh like like i said they patch up more things that are broken in the game like they did nerf some of the monastery bosses but still i'm not sure i found a stupid compass that gave me vision no that's actually good that compass is actually good still man you activate it every night it's basically like a 2000 something turn cooldown or a buff just like the the monastery one here and you get crit chance, vision increase, and uh, what was the other thing? Bonus range, I think? You get like three or four thing things on it. It's pretty good, honestly. If you're melee, not good on mages anymore. I think. Because crit chance doesn't matter on you anymore. But I think the bonus range and all that is still good on you. I'd have to look at it again. I had it, I had it like on two characters. Because all you got to do is just use it once in the night. You can drop it on the floor, come back for it in the morning, and boom. You don't have to take up whole space for the artifact. Since it's it's basically a buff for one day. Now you can activate it like any of the nighttime hours. Like let's say anyone... You can activate at 1 a.m., 2 a.m., 3, 4, I think maybe 5, but somewhere around the early morning hours too. Like, you, that's when you activate it, like around the early morning hours. And then you'll have it basically the whole day still. It's a long, t it has a long buff timer on it, so. You don't have to worry about it for a while. I don't know if they nerfed it or not. I have to see. Because I don't know if they changed some of the artifacts or not. I don't think so, though. Yes, Captain of Deserters. Um, I'll take that. Actually, no, wait, none of it. I need a... Oh, I do not have any more room. I should probably have another purse. Uh, I did not realize I'm this full. Alright, I guess we need more purses. Yeah, you can find more. Just You just gotta wait for the dungeons to reset again. Like, I already did these. Do you remember? I did the outpost. And I did this one over here. The... Hero's Tomb. Oh, they changed it. Oh, no. It's it's still the Hero's Tomb. It just has a name now to it. This is this one. Hero's Mausoleum. You just gotta wait like usual. Reset for dungeons. I think like... How long does it take? Like maybe a whole in-game week? Or maybe five days in-game? And then it'll reset once you... But you have to make sure you finish it though. Because if you don't finish the dungeon boss... Um, it'll still be there. I've noticed that happened be before. I remember one time I did permadev. I killed some of the guys inside the dungeon, but they never left their spot when I came back after weeks. Yeah, it has to be those hidden dungeons. It's the only ones that spawn it. And I think it's specific ones. I think bandit ones spawn specific artifacts, like this one. This one only spawns a certain pool of them. As well as the undead ones spawn specific ones to those. Like the funeral mask. I think you'll find the funeral mask only in crypts. But I'm not 100%. Like, the compass, I know I found it before in the bandit places more often. 
in the hidden dungeons at least. So I'm not sure if I'm right about that, but that's from my personal experience what I've ex happened to come across. But I don't know where you found your compass one, so I could be wrong. But that's just me. But it makes sense that the funeral mass is only in like crypts. It's literally in the name funeral. <laughs> So yeah, like I said, I could be wrong. Yeah, any human forts, any basically uh, brigand camps or whatever, or not camps, uh, du hidden dungeons. There's like different models for it. There's like a really big one that's usually near Bryn. It has a lot of freaking enemies outside, like a lot of bandits, and it has like a weird gate entrance inside. The dungeon. It, it's a lot of. <laughs> like, they're pretty armed. But yeah, stuff like that. Uh, dungeon like that. I'll probably have the compass more. And I found the tapestry there too before. It's a uh, artifact. It takes up like this much space. Like this combined with this square. Like a total of eight tiles, I guess. Yeah. That's how big that tapestry is. But it's really good for melee users. It gives you weapon damage and weapon crit efficiency increase. The only downside is the room it takes, that's it. Everything else is fine about it. Oh yeah. I was meaning to look more into it, but... Because no one's really looked into the artifact system that much, honestly. I have, I think. I don't know if anyone made new videos or not, but... Oh yeah, they also added new, two new artifacts to the game as well, so I don't know. Um, but yeah, like I said, I don't think anyone's done a well detailed guide about artifacts. I think the last time I checked, there wasn't anything about it. Yeah, last time though. This away. Actually, no, I'll take that on me right now. Uh, da, da, da. Yeah, and like, but uh, like I said, I'm pretty sure specific types of dun hidden, hidden dungeons can only spawn specific artifacts. R uh, respective to their um, dungeon type. There's only three, I think. There, yeah, there's a hidden monastery dungeon. There's the usual crypt ones, but hidden. And then there's the bandit ones. I think the bandit ones are the hardest, honestly. Yeah, especially because there's a lot of enemies at the entrance too. If you find the really heavily guarded one. Those are something else. But if you're a mage, you're fine. I, I remember I was fire mage, I just breezed through that one. If you're melee, you might have problems. Uh, what do I want? Wait, I need food. I'll buy more cheese off her. Actually, you know what? No. I'll buy one cheese and I'll buy some vegetables and fruits. From this guy up here. I need food. Stock's bad. Cabbage. Um, how much for the carrots? I'll take carrots. Radishes. I'll take the leeks. I'll just eat some of this. I'll eat some of this first, actually. I didn't really do much. Uh, you are a cheese, yeah. What's <laughs> up, Ivy? We do love to cheese the game, am I right? Any cheese I find, I'll cheese it all the way. That's what it's all about, man. Uh, it's a single player game, anyways. It's not like. Uh, if it was a multiplayer game, that'd be another thing. You know? Doing all these exploits and all that. But like I said, single player game. You can do whatever you want. As long as it's not affecting another player in the game too much, you know. And if there's PvP in the game too, but... <coughs> yeah. That's about it on my standing on that. I remember the good old days of... Putting in cheat codes and San Andreas on the PlayStation. 
Uh, and those are sometimes. Those are sometimes. Now they, they uh, what you call it? They deface the game with their whole remake, and it basically turned out like shit. After they remade Ten Hundred, it's crazy, man. Should have never made remade Ten Hundreds. <laughs> AOA with the car was pug. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, let's see. I remember the San Andreas cheats, so many fun ones to use. Oh, yeah, did I read this? I don't think I did. There we go, I read it. I remember the free jetpack one. Just flying around the jetpack. Those are some times. Um, what's that? I don't need this. I think I can keep everything else. Actually. I don't want this on me. There. Oh, bandit camps over here. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I don't know if I should have been playing on San Andreas at my age when I played it. It was a uh, I don't know what was I in? I can't remember like an ele elementary when I played it. Yeah, but I mean, it's fine. It's not like I messed up my mind or anything, right? <laughs> it didn't mess me up at all. Plus, you had to play it back then, man. It was, it was the bomb back then. Everyone was playing it. When did it come out anyways? I don't know what year it came out. I don't think I got it when it first came out either. I think... I just remember finding it on, it was like Target or something. One of the shelves. I can't remember, honestly. Let me look it up. Uh, when did San Andreas come out? Grand Theft Auto. San Andreas release date. When did it come out? October, oh, maybe I did buy it when it came out. October 26, 2004, really? Wow. This game's a 2000 game? I would've thought this game came out like, on the early, on the 90s. I don't know, maybe it is a 2000 game, so it's been so long. 2004, damn. The game's almost gonna hit 20 years old. Two more years and it's there. It's crazy, man. Oh, shoot. Uh, not one of these things again. I am skipping that. Ah, uh, shit. I think you saw me. That doesn't matter. I'm out. Yo, it came out in 2004, yeah. The game came out in 20, or 2004. <laughs> I say 2020. Uh, then they remade it around, was it last year or this year? I don't remember when they remade the game. It was, it was a mess with the remake. Nice, two for one special right there. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, let's see, I need to head over to the Bastion. Am I close to leveling? I am, I am. Uh, I have so much willpower, my gosh. I'm almost gonna hit the cap. Actually, is there a cap to willpower? <clears throat> I don't know if there is. I know there's a cap for the thresholds, but... Oh no, it is capped. Okay, damn right, 30. <laughs> this is right down the bottom. I guess I am about to hit the willpower cap. Would you look at that? I never thought I would be I reached this point. <laughs> I've never hit the cap on any of the skill points in my playthroughs at all. Probably because I never leveled this high either. I've never had to actually. You now with this new update we kinda have to for the better gear. Oh shoot. 
I don't like this. Can I put a ball here? Um, impulse. He's dead, okay. There. Takes care of those two beefy boys. Uh, hmm. Nothing here. Oh, I saw something. Oh, there's two of them, okay. I'll just put this here. I'll never get through with that in the way. <clears throat> oh, the archer's trying to shoot me from there. Damn archers. Most annoying unit for mages. Especially when you have a bunch of melees in front of you. Then you're screwed. I did two damage with my staff. Wow, I need upgrades badly. My melee sucks, holy. If I did two damage right there. <clears throat> what the heck? Why is this guy electrocuted? Did my thing spread over here somehow? What the heck? Okay, somehow my electricity spell from here reached over here. I don't know. Or maybe this gave him I don't know. I don't know how he got that resonating stack. He had like two left on him too, so... I don't really know what happened there. Oh. Combat one. Okay, never mind. <laughs> At least I know it now. Another one of these. Trash. Uh, let's see. Uh, it's a passive skill in the electric sheet. Yeah, I think that's a proc that I forgot I got it. You're right. It's this one, I think. Resonance Cascade. Oh, that's probably what happened. Oh, no trap right there. Nobody home. <clears throat> nice. Three carrots. this I think I know it. oh I don't okay I leveled up reading it uh, one more there and then I'll get tempest this one's way better than whatever this shit was what is this crappy's passive yeah it's kind of that not that great this one's better now I need to make room for it though um we're just gonna move this out of here and then put it in hot bar too or just impulse since I don't really use it too much anymore. Nice. Now we got the the final spell of uh, electricity that's active. Summon a lightning strike. And then summon two random ones. It's definitely going to be a good AoE spell. Oh, I hear thunder clouds. The thunder is coming. Holy shit. What the fuck? I just... I did a lot. Oh, I should have waited for this guy. Um, does it affect resonating targets more? Deals 48 resonating. Oh my god. And it removes resonating and the chance to stun. The damage of the stun is increased by 10%. For each turn of the... Okay, so it just increases stun values. Depending on the stacks they have. Oh yeah, each time it stuns, I forgot it summons another strike of lightning. So that's why it wants to do that. Okay. How long is this on cooldown? 17 turns. Ah, oh, jeez. That's a lot of turns, my dude. Impulse. Alright, we're gonna have to try that on a bigger party there. I also saw in the, the patch notes, they uh, toned down some of the spawn rates on these. Like, remember how they used to be a shit ton? Supposedly they reduced the amount of enemies that spawn in together with one room. Supposedly. I think I, it is true. I, I've noticed there's a bit less inside these rooms. Oh, he got the shock on him. Nice. Um, they removed him. Okay. Can I do this and it'll reach him from there? Ah, it's too far away. Okay. I thought so. Shit. I didn't see that. 
I didn't realize there was a freaking trap there. I should have looked at the room first. All right, check for another trap. But I broke my entire leg here. Ah, fantastic. Should I disarm it? I don't know if I should disarm it. I could use it. Do I need it though? I don't think I need to rely on it right now. <clears throat> okay, he heard me. Maybe I, maybe I'll have him disarm it if he actually tries to disarm it though. Nah, probably not. Oh, okay. Uh, wasn't expecting that. You know what? This would be safe. I'll disarm it. I don't want to deal with it. All right, let me just uh, do this the right way. Wait, what? What used the durability? Let me just uh, apply. How do I do this again? Oh, there we go. There we go. Instant uh, removal. Wow, the XP gain is really uh, insignificant. 16 XP for disarming a trap. That was not worth. Hold on, let me uh, rest. My leg's kind of broken here. Just heal it up a little more. There. This is the boss room. Jeez, that's a lot of archers. Can I use Tempest, maybe? How is this gonna work, though? Do I have to, okay, I have to target them still. How close do they need to be, though? Summons a lightning, then summons additional lightning strikes to two more enemies within vision. Prioritize the one affected by resonance. Oh. None of them are affected. You know what? Let's just try it. It hits all? Oh, you're right. It did hit all of them. Fucking archers. Oh, no. Yeah, as long as I'm in... I can see them. Okay, you're right. I saw it hit L3 when I... Hit them there. Uh, how healthy are you? 59. Alright, um... Not looking good in health. Maybe I could put a seal down. There we go. He's too far away, I'll use this. There we go. Nice, and that is a good AoE spell. Tempest is just good in general. Though... I don't know if it's gonna do enough to insta-kill anything. Wait, it has an execute actually. I should probably use it when they're lower. I forgot it has an execute thing on it. More likely chance it'll kill them if they're 20% lower. Is that it? Alright, well that was not much to this dungeon. Uh, let's see. I think that was it. I don't see any more rooms that I have not gone into. Alright, wow, that, was, that dungeon was not that big. <laughs> I thought there would have been way more stuff here. Whoa. My character was pathing the wrong way. She was about to step on that. Alright, easy dungeon. Um, my gosh, I have a lot of mysteries everywhere. Oh, here's the herbalist house. We might go to the hero's mausoleum. Let's just see what... Now that I have the rep up, I should probably be able to buy stuff now. Uh, I hope the freaking uh, I think the alchemist is bugged again. Let's see if he opens this stupid door. Last time I left him, he was behind his door. And he might not be able to open it in the morning. Let's go see, though. If not, I'm at the wait till a certain time to open his door and check out his new inventory. Yeah, let's just do that. Just to be safe, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna go to the docks in... I'll save it before they open their shop. I'll just open the door for him so he gets in. Then hopefully he has magic gear now. 
If not, I swear I'm at the grind more rep. Oh shit, um... To not notice that, uh... Okay, it doesn't go immediately at me, what the heck? I was just chilling near him and he didn't even give a shit. I guess somehow he didn't see me. He was suspicious, but he didn't really know where I was. That would have been bad. I have no way to escape close range combat. I can just keep spamming Jolt. I don't know if that's going to do anything. Unless I stun him, I, I don't have a chance to run away that close range. Yeah, I mean a stun can help. And knockbacks. A lot of knockbacks. I just realized there's no move in this game that knocks back more than one tile, is there? Like sometimes you could cheese it if they're like on a corner and you can somehow push them to two tiles, but technically there's no move in the game that pushes more than one. Knockback is only one tile range, that's it. Nothing more. Yeah, it would be cool if there was something that pushed farther. Maybe three tiles away, that way you can like get them off you or more likely chance to hit them against the wall or something. That'd be neat. Yeah, let me leave this behind. Uh, I'm with all this other junk here. Oh, let me check. Does this uh, new book guy ever go to sleep or no? I want to see if he's open at night or not. Let's find out. He is. He never goes to sleep. Okay, that's nice. So I could just sell to him anytime I want. Uh, get out of here. All right, let's turn in the quest so we can get the rip. And let's see what Bryn has for selling in stock now with all this new stuff. It should have. All right, here goes nothing. I don't know if anyone's already looked into this. Where to? If you need tier two rep now or higher than that for magic gear. Oh my gosh! Keeps asking me for shit I don't have. I feel like Dash is most most skill no matter what class. It is, yeah. I think they nerfed it too a bit with this patch or this update. I mean, yeah, I'm pretty sure they up uh, nerfed it a little bit more. What used to be. Uh, I think I'm out of purses with letter empty, right? Let me see. Uh, I forgot to sell that book. Oh, here we go. There's some purses here. Open this. I forgot I had room in here too. Um, let me put that in here for now. Take that one and put that one in there as well. This, this, this. I can merge these, right? There we go, yeah, okay. I'll have to buy a new one. I think that should be it in this too. Alright, let's go sleep at the inn. Alright, now we have... What's a rip here? Um, there we go, tier 2. Favorable prices. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me look at this. Oh yeah, there we go. Better gear plus four. That's what I was looking for. This one. The other ones are just bonuses. Yes. Okay, this one at the tier two as well. Stock size increase. Actually, no, never mind. I was gonna check that guy, but never mind. The the guild quartermaster, whatever his name is. I was gonna see if he had a better loot in there or not. I think they took off a lot of the loot he used to have. I've noticed he doesn't have like I haven't seen any magic gear on him anymore or really like rare and stuff. It's all just generic melee stuff or arrows. All right, lady, give me a room. Cheapest room you got? Got glass shards on the damn floor. One of this room costs or this place is cheap. Uh, five a.m. I just need to 
lockpick his door and then just wait for him. Alright. Should be nearby. Right around here. Uh, this guy's in my way. Alright, let me just make sure I'm using the right crowbar. Oh, doesn't matter either one. There. Oh, thank goodness I just made it in time, holy. If he's caught me there, I would have been in custody. Oh, yep, here we go. Finally. Oh, this is new. What the fuck? Court Mage Cloak. I don't remember ever seeing that. Now we're talking, man. Mage gear everywhere. Priest staff. Stabs everywhere. Enchanter staff. 7% magic power. Okay, okay. Took him a long time just to get all this gear. Jeez. So much rep grinding. Alright, where, where's the Electromancer stuff? I don't think I see it. I don't think he has it. Oh, here we go. Here's a mantle. Is this this Cornomancer helmet? Arcanist. Geomancer. Let me see what they changed. They definitely added some things and removed some things on the armor. Uh, let's see. Chronomancer, just arcane and psionic increase. Cooldown reduction, cryonic power. Did the Pyromancer helmet always have fire resistance? I don't remember that. Geomancer has a shit ton of stuff going on. Jeez. That's a lot of different things there. How about the bracers? What the heck? Wait a minute. That wasn't there before. Bracers didn't have negative shock resistance before. Yeah, that wasn't there. Those are the ru or the sapphire ones. Where are the ruby ones? It doesn't have them right now. Uh, how much for the mantle? What do I lose? Oh my god, 30% more electricity power. Jeez. That's a big increase compared to my mantle here. 15 magic. That's double, actually. But in, mostly specifically to electricity, though. Let's see, Miracle Chance, still the same. I lose Potency, so I lose Crit Damage Increase. Uh, spell Energy Cost, the same. I get Cooldown Reduction now. I lose Bleed Resistance, but who cares? It's not like it was doing anything. Shock Resistance Increase, but it's only on my chest, so it doesn't really matter. Same with Magic. Eh. I kind of hate that. These resistances only apply to your specific body part, whatever the armor associated with it is. I, I, I would have rather it been my entire body would have gotten those stats, not just this. Uh, I guess that's how they balance it, I think. Uh, oh yeah, Ooh, what the heck? Pyromancer Mantle now has backfire chance? What the heck? That wasn't there before. Yeah, 5% more chance to backfire your spell. Wait, 33%? What the heck? This one has 3% more than anything else. That's a lot of pyro power. Anything else look different? Everything has 30%. Damn, they gave pyromancy 33% more. <laughs> Checked it up a little more. <clears throat> um, how about this new cloak? Dodge chance, backfire reduction, miracle increase. Oh, wow, this is really good. I gotta use this for the troll fight. Maybe I should just buy it now. I have the money. It's not like I don't. Um, Alright, let's go get the money. I left it behind. <clears throat> Is it the only one that sells it, though? Is the question. Now that I increase everyone's rep. Ruby necklace? Yeah, see, this guy has the new stuff now. Spell recost, reduction, healing, gold sapphire. Oh, I need one of these. This is good for me, Gold Sapphire Ring. I can get rid of this shitty cursed one. Plus three energy, energy restoration, magic power, magic resistance. All right. Um, what's the Sapphire have on it? It's really bad, oh my gosh. <laughs> for a necklace, that's not great. This is, wait, is this better than the Sapphire? <laughs> wait a minute. This is way better than the Sapphire necklace. How's that possible? 
How is a tier two vendor item better than a tier one gold necklace? I mean, tier one gold necklace better than a tier two. <laughs> yeah, that sapphire necklace isn't worth it all. Still trash as always. All right, I gotta go to the bank. I left all my money there. Let me just sell some of this stuff too. Or, you know what, while I'm here, let's check these guys. I don't think they have anything, but let me just check. Um, oh, he does have something new. Exquisite staff. Block chance, crit chance. This is more of a melee weapon, if anything. Not Nothing more. He has jousting armor, as usual. Um, veteran's longsword. Any new helmets? Nah, I don't see anything new. Same old, same old. Maybe some stats change around, but... Yeah, same old, same old. He does have a staff, though. Not a great one, but... Something. I don't think I can talk to this guy in the middle of the day. He still doesn't seem to work that way. Yeah, he doesn't seem to be. I feel like he may have some staffs I need. You guys remember what Electromancy staff was? Was it a metal staff? I'm pretty sure, right? Or was it a wooden staff? It has to be metal, right? Whoa, what do they do to this? Oh, that's the same. Never mind. That's the same thing. Oh, he, no, he doesn't have any cows. No, he doesn't have any magic gear other than the basic one I have on me. This guy is kind of not, not useful anymore. Any boots, though? There's no magic boots. When are they going to add magic boots in the game? I swear. I want magic boots. <laughs> they have everything but the boots. <clears throat> Alright, let me just repair my crowbars while I'm here. One of them's about to break. Oops, wrong one. Repair. How about the necklace? Why not? <clears throat> All right, uh, I want to get this. This will definitely increase my damage output. If I get 1% for each ability, that's a, considered a magic skill. That's going to be a lot of increase in magic power. That's a big DPS boost. <clears throat> um, I don't think I need this, right? What's good about Alvinice? Uh Actually, it's not that bad. It gives more. Oh, 15, actually. Never mind. I'm going to keep it. <clears throat> Once I buy that... Oh, actually, I'm already here. Might as well buy the ring. I need a sapphire ring. I don't know if I'll ever find one in the world, so I'm just going to buy one off this guy. Oh, does he not sell it? What the heck? Where is it? The other guy had it. How come this guy doesn't have it? Actually, his loot hasn't changed. This is all the shit stuff. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's why. Uh, when you kill a troll in perma, will he not respawn? Question mark. I don't know. I've never gone back to check. I've killed him countless times in permadeath, but like I said, I've never gone back. So usually I end the series for that class and then start a new one. Uh, I don't know if anyone has any information on that in chat. Because I'm pretty sure I don't really know anything. I've never gone back. Uh, I feel like he should respawn now. Like, after like so many time has passed though. Okay, this guy's... For some reason, this guy's inventory hasn't changed compared to the other ones. Um, I guess that guy in the guild market over there has some more. Let me just... Uh, Make room here. Put this away for now. And this. I need to make as much room as I can. I go to my bank. Yeah, for some reason, these guys' inventory hasn't changed yet. Alright, time for the... The rich money... Rich man's money deposit. How much do I have now, actually? I had like 20k last time I checked. Um, sh uh, 18,000... 
22,000. 26,000 gold, jeez. Uh, that's a lot of money. Oops, actually, I need 2,000 in there. Alright, well, we're ready to buy stuff, so. I was going to spending spree. I could buy the cowl at least, or the mantle. I, I'm still missing the helmet and the staff. I could buy a sapphire ring in the docks. Alright, I think that should be good, I hope. To hold me off until they restock again. Oh my gosh, these guys keep asking me, I swear. What's going on? They keep looking for stolen goods when I don't have anything. It's happening all over again. Damn guards. They didn't do their job catching me in the first place. What are they gonna catch me now? I don't think so. I'm a professional here. I got crowbars ready to pry open some doors and chests like nothing. Uh, so I don't know why this guy has better stuff than the other guys, which is weird. I don't know if it's cheaper. It looks cheaper. A thousand, right? That's pretty cheap. Like, actually, is it? Is that cheap for what it is? I just have so much money, I, I think if it's cheap now. Uh, this is expensive for sure. This ruby necklace. Alright, I'm gonna buy the ring anyway, so. I'm at the cleanse. I need to cleanse this. How much for this? 73? No, no way. <laughs> Maybe it isn't cheap. That's a lot of money. For one stupid scroll. Um, how much for Hornet Honey? Actually, it's not good on me anymore. Yeah, Hornet Honey's not good on me anymore. Let's screw that then. I guess the Dodge Chance is still good, but I mean, everything else, like Crit Chance, is great. Um, I need to make room. There. Give me the Electromancer mantle. Look at that armor, three. That is just really pathetic armor, but... Hey, we're glass cannon anyway, so... Geomancer's only one with better armor value, but that's even not that great. That's like a one dam or resistant increase, I think. Oh, no, it's the same. Never mind. That's not even an increase in protection. Whatever, we're not here for the protection, I guess. We're here for the stats. Alright, it's starting to look a little bit better though. Um, should I buy the the cloak? I don't think I'm gonna find anything better than that. Can't buy any of the helmets right now. How much for the cleansing scrolls? That's still a lot, my gosh. Um, how much for the enchants then? Jeez. Alright, let me think this through. Can I sell this to anybody? Nobody here. Should I buy any of these shitty staffs? Probably not. Nah, I'm gonna wait. I need an Electromancer staff. These are all bad. They're not respectively good for my class. Alright, um, I need to make room again. So I'm just gonna drop that. Buy again. I got the money, might as well spend, spend, spend. Should I wear it though? Or should I dip the backpack? I'm gonna lose a lot of extra space, but I'm gonna get more damage with this now. Or at least the extra stuff, not too much, but something. How's it look? Let me see actually. I can't really tell that much since it's in my back. Um, these are empty, okay. I'll come back from them another time. Uh, shit, I need to eat the cabbage. Alright. I got what I needed. Finally got my Chronomancer's mantle. Or not Chronomancer, <laughs> Electromancer. Uh, I need to cleanse this off. I don't remember where I left my... Cleansing scrolls in Bryn. I don't know if I have any actually in Bryn. Yeah, I don't recall leaving any here. 
get my stuff out. Yeah, I don't think I left any in here. Um, fuck. I can't put this new ring on if I don't remove the one I have from, with the curse on it. Which am I going to remove, actually? Um, huh. This one hasn't really been useful to me at all. This one's kind of a hindrance with the morale, but energy matters. I think I'm just going to get rid of this one. I need to make room. Urge. Put that on the floor. All right. Um, <laughs> I need to go buy a cleansing skull, I guess. I, I don't want to buy one here, but I don't think I have a choice. Since I have to go back to Manshire to get my ones I left behind, and that's just basically a lot of money traveling there. Yeah, it's not worth. Um, 73 cheese. Whatever, I have to remove it. At least I can sell this ring to the jeweler. There we go, new ring on. That's one less curse now. How much for the mantle? Cheese, really? I paid a lot for this. Well, I'm never going to get the full price back anyways. Um, might as well get rid of it now. I don't want to go all the way to Osbrook just to sell it. Do I need anything from this guy? Yeah, Splint. Okay. Alright, um... Let me leave behind this money in the bank. Of course, this guy's blocking me. This guy's taking his sweet time walking. Blocking the entire entrance. For like 10 turns. Merge. Alright, I spent like... I don't know how much I spent, actually. I spent 10,000 already? I'm not sure. Oh, wait. I need that one. Oh, wait. Ah. I have stuff in my backpack I don't need. Um... I'll leave it like that. Let's go to an inn. I need to save it and get the vigor buff. It's important. Um, I don't need my rep hire anymore, right? That's all the. I just need to wait for like a stock reset in order for it to see like better loot on there or something like a electromancer mental, right? Or helmet, I mean. Because all I'm missing is a staff and the helmet. I'm not sure if it's within my reputation rank or not. I know the helmet should be, but I don't know about the staff. Uh, I'll have to see, though. There. Made a lot of money off that gold ring. It's worth a lot. I love how gold stuff is worth a lot in this game, but when it comes to the nugget, it's not worth anything. I find that a bit ridiculous. <laughs> Why is a gold nugget not worth much when jewelry itself is worth more? Is it because the nugget's not that much gold, is that why? This jewelry is just the more refined. Uh, let's save the game. There we go. Let's do my strat. Hold up, while I'm here, I might as well do my cheese strat. Garbage. I need energy on it or something. Something useful. Physical, that is just straight up garbage. Garbage again. Magic and physical, those just really aren't that great. <clears throat> I need something universal that's not just for the chess piece. Dodge chance, that's not bad. I could maybe work with that for now. Wait, but I'm not melee like I said. What's my dodge chance with this? Where is it? 17. Do I really want to care about that much in dodge? I don't actually. 
Surprisingly, we're not going dodge anymore. <laughs> Usually we go dodge a lot. But since uh, we're not melee, it's not important that much. And dodge chance doesn't really help. Oh, here we go. Energy. Nice. I got what I needed. Like I said, dodge doesn't really help a lot with range spells. It kind of sucks against it. It's like half the, <clears throat> the chance on it to work. Especially magic. It hardly even works against magic spells. Alright, I got what I need to do. Energy on my chest piece. This. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. If I'm going to switch out or not. Well, actually, I am. I need magic bracers. That's right. Alright, I'm going to put my new cloak on. I'm uh, Actually, wait, I'm going to put leave this backpack somewhere. Oh my gosh, this guy's blocking the entire alleyway. What's an NPC's blocking choke points in this place? Uh, oh, he did it. Restock. Okay, wait a minute. This guy restocked. What's the uh? Nah, the this ruby ring is not that great. Is there a gold ruby ring? Maybe the silver one sucks. <clears throat> oh, that'd be cool if there was a gold ruby necklace. I don't know. I think there is, but you never know. I could be wrong. Maybe there is. I'll leave this behind. Oh, my cheese went moldy. Here, you can have it. Ch moldy cheese. <clears throat> Alright. Wait, if he restocked, does that mean the potion guy restocked? Huh. Let me check. Oh yeah, let me check the elves. What do they got on sale now? Oh, what's this? Orient bracers. Not bad. Magic, three percent energy, three. Backfire reduction. It's okay. Though I don't know. I think the ruby or sapphire ones might be better. Uh, anything else magic related maybe? Um, I don't think so. I've never bought any, any elven armor other than the cloak maybe. It's so freaking expensive. It's ridiculous. She has nothing. Well, they have nothing I want. <clears throat> All right, let me check the book guy too. He might have something new in his books. Maybe. Just maybe. Give me all your garlic. Delicious garlic. Gives me unholy resistance. Ah, uh, no, he did not. Sadly, he does not get any book increases or anything like that. Yeah, I guess you gotta go to the Willow Tavern for tier three books. In magic, at least. I don't. Sh I'm not sure where you're supposed to get other tier books or tier three for other skills that aren't magic. Oh, that guy. Uh, any vendors in Bryn might sell them, but it's just random. It's not consistent. Oh wait, uh, I forgot the damn holy buff. You know, before let's just go do the quest first. Might as well do that. I wanted to check the pushing guy, but I don't know. My bus gonna run out if I don't go now. So he might have some new stuff now. There you go, farewell. <laughs> Alright. I think I could fight the troll. Once I get my gear I need and let me see where is it? I need this spell. Arcane lore. This for sure will boost my damage. Actually this might be useful against a troll. Seal of shackles. This hind should hinder him from spell casting too much. Minus energy, minus oh yeah, double the cost of spells for him. Ah, oh, fuck. Hold up. Oh, cooldown duration. 50% more holy. 
Yeah, he shouldn't be spamming rocks then with that. Fumble chance, 20%, wow. Can't cast spells. Okay, well, it doesn't matter, actually. I don't think his, he has skills, not spells. So that shouldn't really affect him. What do you have? Same old, same old. Looks like he didn't restock. How about you? Please tell me you restocked. It has a low range, really? Oh, shit. It might be problematic. <laughs> um, he didn't restock either. How come they did? What, what's going on? Wait a minute. What the heck? How come the other vendors restock and this guy did not? This doesn't make sense. Yeah, this does not make sense. Let me grab that. Are they on a different timetable now? For loot restocking? That's kind of weird. I think they are. I think there are loot tables where every vendor's messed up right now. They're supposed to restock all at the same time. But this guy did not. And the dock guy neither. Alright, let me check the range. I guess. Oh my gosh, it keeps haggling me. Damn guards. Uh. Oh my god, you're right. That is horrendous. Five. You do not want to be that close. What's my shortest spell range here? Six, Jolt. I think Jolt's the shortest. Oh no, here we go. Chain Lightning is too. Oh, ball of lightning. Oh, but this should increase the range. Seal of power? As long as I'm in the magic mastery one, I get one more range for one turn. And this should be uh, six tiles instead of five. But I don't know. That's not much of a difference. Let's try a quest. Let's try our new gear now. Oh, he does have some magic stuff. I already have all this. Here's a Barbaro helmet for sale. Uh, where's the dungeon at? Over there, okay. Alright, well, the range of that uh, shackle spell is the same as my chain lining and ball lining anyway, so... It's not like it makes a difference. I can't really use chain lightning against the troll, it's useless. I just realized that. Um, Can I use Tempest from here? Move up one. Okay, somehow they merged into each other. Nice. I don't know how those weird wolf things merged into each other. Okay, their, their tile range is weird now. Somehow this guy's on this tile, but somehow he's in, inside his tile, but on another tile at the same time. Uh, let's... What's going on with their pathing? Okay, yeah, let's see. Some of the some of my Lecture Master spells are basically useless against the troll. Because a lot of them are AoE. This one specifically, it's kind of trash. Against Seagull Target. <clears throat> yeah. This probably be bad too, unless I just need a filler spell. It'll it'll only do more damage if there's more targets affected by it. And with the troll fight, there's no ad, so... Oh, thank goodness there's no ad. Holy, if there was. That'd be even worse. But yeah, um... That's not gonna do much. This will at least be useful still. Uh, this will be useful still. This, I don't know if this will be good, because it costs a lot of energy for what it is. I guess a single target. Actually, maybe this will be good to kill him off. Because it says it instantly kills 20%. Does that apply to bosses? Does anyone know if executes apply to bosses? Because I've never really tried using an execute on a boss of any skill. I always kind of forget and I never use it to finish him off. doesn't say anywhere that it excludes bosses or any kind of enemies. Unless they don't tell us. Could be either one. I 
All right, I should. Damn, my max health is only at 100. Wow, it's kind of bad. If I don't invest the vitality, it's just gonna be low. Or if I don't get any enchants with health on it either. Oh, my bigger buffs are running out. What the heck? There's a lot of ghouls out here. Alright, time for the big lightning. I forgot I left these guys here. Doesn't matter, they're weak. Wait a minute, what the heck? Where did those sticks come from? Did did my lightning thing just destroy the fence? Or was this always here? Were these sticks always here? Hmm. I'm assuming it attacked the terrain. Wait a minute, what? Did my lightning strike do that? I wasn't paying attention too much. It looked like it broke the fence to me, or a tree. Because there's sticks on the floor when there shouldn't be sticks here. Yeah, there, there's never any in the graveyards. Oh, what are they doing here? That's a lot of enemies over there. Power to him. Oops, whatever. Ball lightning. That's a lot of them, okay. Big lightning. <laughs> nice, I love that spell. Uh Chain Lightning. It didn't oh he's not electrocuted, that's why. Oh no he is, why why didn't it go to him? What the heck? Something wrong with chain lightning? It didn't jump to the resonating target. Like it was supposed to. Alright, um... Kinda low on energy here. I regen 8 per turn. That's not a lot. Or I mean 8 per rest. I don't know about normally. I need more maximum energy to increase that. You would think energy restoration would have affected more, but it's not really. The higher energy pool, the better your number is on restoring it. It does help, but you need a really high number for it to make a difference. That's why I focus on pure energy increase instead of energy restoration. Yeah. Energy restoration is more of a secondary thing to focus on. If you want to regen more, which is weird, you would think. Focusing on energy restoration would help you restore more. It doesn't. Not that much. Better just go in raw energy. Since it seems to scale more off that. Okay, did he not get electrocuted? Did not. I can use one of his moves. Nothing. Just checking if I forgot anything on the floor. Couple coin. Ah, shoot, damn. Thing got in the way. Alright, that takes care of him. Hmm, nothing here. This is open. Okay, good, it's just a mage. Oh, if it was a melee unit, that'd be not something else. Uh... All 
Uh, I can just ball lightning him. Why not? Let's just spam. Actually, let's use Tempest. Big damage. Uh. Holy, that's a lot of them. I could just block them off though. Well, I could use Tempest if I resonate enough of them. Um, huh. I should use them now, probably. Holy shit, I just hit everything. <laughs> Pretty good, man. That's pretty good. Can't hit him with that. They gotta increase the range on chain lightning, I swear. Its range is really short. How is Jolt better range than chain lightning? I don't know why. I can feel like I hardly use this at all. Because I have to... If I hit the resonating target and sometimes they're close to me, I can't hit the secondary. Unless they're really close. Like this thing. Chain that needs a bit of a range increase. Maybe like one more tile, I don't know. So, um, same distance as Jolt. Especially for how much it costs. 17. Well, it's probably a lot since I have reductions, but... For what it is, yeah. All right, uh... <clears throat> Whatever, it's breaking that down, I'm just gonna let them break it. Well, looks like they gave up, okay. Well, I'm not going there. They're not opening it, I'm not opening it. Okay, I guess I have to go that way. <laughs> looks like there's no other option. All right, I don't know what was trying to break the door down. Oh, bunch of bats. I put a ball of lightning. Can't reach him. If I can't reach him with Joel, I can't reach him with chain. Yep, that's. I got another ball of lightning. Two balls of lightning. Holy shit, what's the cooldown on that right now? Five turns, wow. I wonder how I was able to put another one. <laughs> Two balls. Maybe three balls, maybe. Where'd he go? Oh, there. He died. Uh, I can't reach him from here. Still can't reach him. There. <clears throat> oh. What I'd like to see. If these are the primal elements of magic. Or basically we're using primal magic in the game from the lore perspective. It'd be nice to see uh, elementals. Ah, shoot. Um, this is going to play out bad. Oh, thank goodness he didn't hook me. Let's use this. Yeah, I like to see some elementals. And we can summon our own. <clears throat> A lightning elemental to help us out. Little minion. Another one's depending on what uh, element it is, like fire, uh, geomancy, and all that. I don't know how they balance it, but that'd be nice. <clears throat> It'd be nice as an enemy too, I guess. That definitely switch up some of the enemies. <laughs> to 
I have an elemental you can kill. Since there's not many magic enemies in the game. Let alone like specific elements like that. It's mostly unholy. Yeah, it's mostly unholy. Magic. Some fire here and there, but that's about it. Nothing more. Uh, still too far away. Uh, let's do that. This guy should be easy to kill. He dropped a necklace. Why did he? S well, that's interesting. He dropped a uh, an archer amulet <laughs> when he's not an archer himself. <laughs> it's kind of weird. At least. Hey, wait a minute. This is a Brin dungeon. Why is there a tier one skeleton here? Well, that's weird. This whole dungeon's weird. Um. Eat as much garlic as I can. Oh, I dropped the staff. Um, I don't need this. What do I have? This copper necklace. I already read this, right? Yeah, I did. Already, I could sell it for money though. Um, oh, I can use this on my ring actually. I have to save it. Um, I think there is a update in Brin that can generate tier two or tier three dungeons. Oh, really? No. Oh, it's kind of it's kind of stupid. <laughs> well, um, take that. I'll use this on that. Anti venom. Okay. Uh, I kind of want to take the staff, but at the same time, I don't have room. I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna have room at all when I open this. Uh, yep. Oh my gosh, gold necklace. This is really good. Uh, huh. I'll eat more food then. Um, shoot. I'll check the other one too before I. Oh my gosh, even another gold necklace. Holy. This place is just loaded with loot. Ah, <laughs> uh, what the heck am I gonna do? How much is this necklace worth? Only 196. I might just drop it then. I'll take this. Um, I have to eat my last garlic for room for that. Gold teeps are not worth much, so I'm gonna leave that. This should be worth more than the gold too, if yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, trash. Damn. The one time I get rid of my backpack, so much good loot. I can't pick up that stuff. All right, um, let's execute him with lightning bolt strike. Nice. Guaranteed kill right there. Or maybe I just did enough. I don't know. <laughs> I can't tell. I have to inspect him and see if he's down to 20. Oh, I don't have any more scrolls to identify though. Or maybe there was a delay. I could cleanse it, but I'm gonna save that for my other ring. Oh, you mean cleansing my curse ring? Oh, I don't want to cleanse it right now. I should probably mention that. Um, I'm waiting till I find another sapphire ring, and I can cleanse it, cause I still want the enchant on it. The curse is bad, but the enchant is good right there. Seven more energy. Yeah, that was my bad. I didn't really clarify it. Uh, but I am, I am gonna cleanse it though eventually. That's why I'm saving this. Since I don't want to buy another one, it's expensive. Really expensive. Alright, I think we're done with Brin Quest for now since I can't do any more. I have to wait till the reset again. I'm gonna go do the uh, hidden dungeon then. I found the one we didn't go to on Friday. Hopefully there's another artifact in there I can take. How's my cloak doing? Okay, it's doing fine. Can't enchant my weapon since it's unique. Doesn't really matter too much though. 
since I don't melee it. <laughs> I just have it as a stat stick, basically. Yeah, my, my weapon is just a stat stick, honestly. That's all I have it for. Nothing more. Just to look pretty, you know. Maybe I'll whack an enemy or two with it, but it's honestly the worst damage ever for melee. So, best not do that. And it breaks down faster too, I notice. When you actually use it to melee, it actually does break down faster. If I don't use it to hit anything, it's basically going to stay perfect condition. Which is interesting. <clears throat> Makes you not have to repair a lot on weapons at least. As long as you're not meleeing. Actually, you know what? Uh, I'm going to check this guy. Does he got anything on the shop? Oh, he's sleeping. Oh, no. Oh, he has a lot of cool stuff here. Um, definitely worth a lot of stuff here for money wise. I'll have to sell it somewhere else though. Uh, let's see. What's on the floor? Iron ingot, pain killing. I'm gonna leave this with that pain killing one. Bunch of purses. I might need one actually for money room. There we go. Is that a jobs? All right, so technically for the final rep for Bryn, all I need is 6K, I think. Unless I'm wrong, unless they change it. Wait a minute. Was it always 9K? Was reputation always 9,000? I just realized that. No, right? Was the max was 6,000 before, no? Did they up it? Well, maybe it was. I just realized. I think it was, but I, we never really had a reason to max it out. I think. I'm pretty sure the next tier is 6,000. So I need three more quests, which is another reset. I might need another purse, actually. Since this jewelry is definitely worth money. What's well, not broken that most? Okay, this one's not broken too much. I'm trying to think here. I feel like with this update, you're less incentivized to use the traveling system. Am I right? Am I right or wrong? I don't know. But I feel like we're having to pay for the taxi service now. It makes me less want to travel around the, the world in the carriage now. And more just staying near Bryn at this point. I try not to leave Bryn, honestly, at this point. Well, let me see if the... I want to check the carpenter. Yeah, I want to check the carp... Oh my god, <laughs> this is a line of... It's the human centipede over here, holy. Guys, uh, I just walked to the door like nothing. Hopefully he's at his... Yeah, there he is. Let me talk to him. Um, Still crap. Even though he got better gear and stuff. All of it's still crap to me. I think the carpenter might be useless to mages now. He used to have some stabs. I don't see anything anymore. I don't think it's worth bribing him if he has this kind of crap. It's only good if you need bows. Maybe some shields, but I think the other guy sells better shields. Um, what was oh yeah, I was gonna sell jewelry. Just fix all that. Oh yeah, and he's already at his room. How is he? How did he beat me? Th That's weird. Usually he's here, and then he starts walking up. If I haven't come in here in a while. Now he's instantly at his room. Huh. Alright, well I guess I have to wait till the morning. I can't do anything during the night. Oh wait, I need to rent it. Okay, something's bugged. The girl, you need to walk over the counter to talk to her. But her mom, you just talk to her over the counter. And everything's fine. With the padding. It's really weird. What's going on there? 
Why is one of them broken and one of them isn't? Is this a bug? Look, watch. See, I could just talk to her and then the girl over there, I couldn't. Something's definitely wrong with her. <laughs> that girl just wants to be close, yeah. She see, she's saying, you're saying she's a slut. She's trying to bribe me with her looks for, in order to get my money. That's what I'm getting at. That's what I'm, I'm getting at right now. Holy, that was a lot of money. Um, I can't sell this ring anymore now. He does not have the money anymore. How about this? He does have okay. That's all I can afford to sell. <laughs> yeah, I kept. Uh, she's a gold digger, man. Why do you think she looks miserable? She's trying to get out of there. Just trying to grab some money from rich dude or rich woman since Arna's a female. Now sometimes I don't realize Arna's a girl since she doesn't look like it too much with her gear on. Oh no Arna, I mean um fucking uh Jonah here. Jonah. Oh wait, what did I find? I found something what was it? I didn't even pay attention. It was something weird. Crawler, uh, camp, purplest. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of text. Oh, here we go. This is a Dur Lebron Manor. Uh, I always thought something was off about the place. Host, rest his soul. Why in the right mind? When the right mind would build themselves a manor in the middle of the woods. All right, I guess we're heading there. Since, uh, we need to go to the mausoleum anyways. I just need to make sure I have the gear, though. Um, I have a splint. I got everything. Okay, I think. I'll buy a leech. No, actually, he's too expensive. I'll buy it off Manshire. Sell this. Sell this. Um, this thing, too. <clears throat> I'll keep this for myself. I'll put it on... Not right now, because I need a grind rep, or XP, I mean. But eventually I put it back on. So I'm just going to hold it off somewhere. Um, I think we're done with this spot here. Let's go to the book guy and get rid of these. And we'll head over to Matt Shire for the new stuff. They got over there on this left side of the map. all he's got. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, thank goodness for that bookstore guy. I hated always having to go to Manshire just to sell my books. Just to get the most profit. Alright, let's get out of here. I think I got in everything I need. Wait, what? Uh, ah, whatever. Let's see, what happened to my cleansing scroll? I forgot I left it over there by the guy. I can just get another one at Manshire. I have more. This guy doesn't have anything new. Oh, this is only 29. I'll buy that. Why not? How much for the pancakes? The soup was cheap. Okay, that was cheaper than anything else. <clears throat> this guy's taxi service is too expensive. Alright, uh... I have his items ready for his quest, actually. I forgot to take it, but now I finished it. Easy as that. I had the moose antlers and the deer antlers ready. <clears throat> uh, uh, let me see. Um, I, thinking of, uh, I could enchant my cloak. I could do the enchant thing on it. Buy all this for food purposes. <clears throat> Alright, we're gonna have to sleep off the night here.
I need my vigor buff. As well as one of these. That's garbage. I'm just in it for the money, I guess, at this point. I don't think I need another one. I'll buy a leech. Whoa, okay. Antitoxin gives fatigue now? What the heck? <clears throat> no, that's not that much. It's like 2.50, right? Not the 25 turns. Yeah, I like 2.50. That's not a much. That's not a lot of fatigue. And it's not immediately either, so I guess it's good. Crawlerboro again. Alright, let's sleep over here. Actually, how's my crowbar doing? Before I go, I should probably repair this. Pair. Pair, pair. There. I don't know if I left any money here. It's been a while since I've been a mention. Uh. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, I forgot to rent a room again. God damn it. I have a lot of these. Holy. Um, that away. Too many of these, I guess. That's good. I don't know why I still have a monk staff. I'm going to leave one of these. Probably get rid of that. I have a lot of enchant scrolls. I got so many. It ain't no joke. Let's grab a little bit of those. I have bear traps I forgot about. I'll keep that on. Actually, I'll leave it here. I don't need him on me. I need to leave this behind too. I'll sell that. I'll leave this behind. Alright, let's enter room. How much... We got here. No rumors, huh? Sad. Some sad times. Alright, let's do the enchant strat. Here we go. Not good. Not good. Oh. Well, oh yeah, third try is good enough for me. I wasted a good amount of scrolls or whatever. I'd rather get it now than ho keep resetting the damn thing. I don't want to do that. Alright, uh... Let's merge. Let's get some of this. And make sure I have enough food for the journey. <clears throat> Alright, we're going left. We're gonna go explore for the mausoleum. First, trash. Sell the rest of the garbage I have on me. I need as much space as I can handle. Here, and then drop that. I think we're good. Let me just get the holy buff and we're good. Off we go. Damn, I have a shit ton. Look at that. I have 163 energy. Holy. That's a lot of energy. Plus 5 from this. Plus 5 from that. Plus 5 from that. 15 already. And then 20 actually from the belt. Because I have 5 more in there. <clears throat> Which can I get? Let's see. If I keep going pure energy and chance. 25, 30, 35, 40, 50, 45. 45 energy max. If I get pure energy ones. <clears throat> Which shouldn't be too hard. And the weapon, I can get something related to the weapon. I don't know what, like, maybe a magic power? Yeah, I'll probably go for magic power. I don't know if how that affects it that much, though. Actually, I probably should do a good amount. Usually it's like 10% magic power increase. Usually. 
I could be wrong. <clears throat> but until we get our uh, Electromancer staff, we won't know. Okay, we have a lot of mysteries. Each one is worth, like, XP. How do we want to go about this? I guess we'll do, like, a cross up here and then just zigzag back down. <clears throat> yeah, we'll do that. Uh, this thing's in my way. I forgot to mention, technically you can do these dungeons, the quest ones, without taking the quests. And when you go back to the guy, you can turn it in, but the thing is, you get reduced rep. And uh, reduced the reward money too. Unless it's a turn in, like, like you have to pick something up from the chest. You're gonna get full everything, but if it's not, if it's just supposed to be just kill the guy, then you don't get much reward or rep because of it. Unless they changed it, but that's how it was before the patch. I did it before, I was like, you know what, what if I just... Since fatigue wasn't in the game yet. Technically, you could just run through all the dungeons in the area. And just turn, turn them all in at once, if you knew where they were. But that's not a thing anymore. I don't know if you can do that many dungeons without fatiguing. Real quick. Real fast. Usually you can only handle like one dungeon before you start experiencing fatigue. And even if you have the buff to it. Maybe you could do it too actually. Maybe. Tempest. Oh wow, that killed him. Okay. Got a free camp over here. Alright, these enemies are weak. Oh, what the heck? I found something blue. Um, whoops. Actually, hit sticky keys. I don't have anything, and it's probably melee based armor. Like, uh, what level can you do? Two or three dungeons. Uh, I mean, like back for four. What well, depends on the area? Like in Osbrook. Uh. I say one to five. Between one and five, maybe around level three, you can probably just you could have done all of them. But with these new changes, I don't know. Like back then, I'm 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 saying things from back then, but around Manshire, I think I was around like level five to ten, or maybe even less, maybe five to nine, or around there. <clears throat> but since the monastery got updates, I don't think you could do all three anymore. You definitely have to, unless you're well stocked, maybe. I don't, I don't think it's a thing anymore. Well, I guess, yeah, if you're well geared now, like I am now, you could probably do them easily. <clears throat> I don't know, it's been a while. I haven't done it in a while, so. I remember back then I was just like zooming through them. Like, I think I was like, by level 6 or 7, I'd already be in Bryn. Or maybe earlier than that 5. I just zoomed through like quests. Back then. And I'd just be at Bryn already and I, it wouldn't... I'd be pretty set by then. But yeah. <clears throat> Uh, oh shoot. I haven't really been like spamming dungeons as much because, like I said, if you just go to them without taking the quest, uh, you don't get the full rewards usually in terms of money and rep. Yeah, that's how it tends to be. <clears throat> That's why we don't really do unless it's hidden dungeons. If there's a bunch of hidden dungeons near themselves, maybe it's a good idea to knock them all down in one go. But usually, not really. It doesn't seem to be the case. A lot of the hidden dungeons are separated pretty far. What the heck is this a dungeon? Oh no, it's the manor. Okay, it looked like a. Uh, I saw a building. I thought it was a dungeon. 
I forgot the manor has its own structure. Here we go. I think if you sleep here, when you come out, there's bandits waiting outside for you. I remember that happened before. I think it still happens. Let me see. This place has some secrets to it. Basically like a bandit camp. Someone hanging on the damn roof. <clears throat> Savages, man. Savages. Yeah, right here. Here's a secret entrance. There's a door here. No enemies here though, but it's definitely being used by somebody. A lot of cabbages. Holy, that's a lot of vegetables. He's just chilling there, yeah. A lot of weapons. Interesting. These weapons are pretty good for early game if you come across this place. Or maybe it's because my level side. Ooh. Pyro 2? Nice. I already know it. Alright. <clears throat> What's this? Swords 2. Wow, this place has a lot of good stuff. Pretty good books. Ooh, a bison pelt. Holy shit. Oh my god. That's a lot of good loot. Brandy, Manny, Colossusel. Holy. I think I have too much. I need the bison pelt for sure. Fuck. Uh, I don't have a backpack anymore. Let me see here. Let me let me sleep it off a little. Do I get vigor buff for this or no? <clears throat> I don't. You don't get vigor buff. I'm gonna drop that. Fuck. I don't really have room. I'm gonna drop this maybe. Jeez, that takes a lot of space. Uh was not expecting that much room to be taken up. Alright, yeah, I think there's gonna be bandits watch. Oh what is this? What the heck? What I could take that? What the fuck? That's new. What is this? Is this worth anything? This is a new item I've never seen. It is. <clears throat> Black boarhead. Huh. No, give me my gosh damn pelt back. There's gonna be bandits watch. Yep, there they are. There, lads. Look, who the hell is this wench? We get her, boys. Uh, I guess you'll you'll end up dying, my dudes. All right, big time, big lightning. And the ringleader's already dead. GG. <clears throat> that was easy. Ringleader died immediately. Only one left is him. This poor chap is dead. He's bleeding out already. <clears throat> oh, that didn't really take much. Yeah, this these guys were hiding out here. That's why there was so much loot. Basically, they're freaking hideout. Well, that was easy. <laughs> I killed the boss just like nothing. I guess you're supposed to find this place when you're lower level. But since I didn't, uh, like maybe mid-tier? Yeah, this place seems like a mid-tier place, but... Like I said, I, uh, barely found out about it. <laughs> so there's, a. Uh... I think I have enough ingots for the blacksmith's quest now. I have one back at Bryn, and then I have two more in Manshire. And the quest is at Manshire, so all I gotta do is go back to Bryn. Now the last one I left behind. Alright, uh... This place is a lot bigger than I thought. Let's just head straight down to the mausoleum now. Let's stop uh, exploring these areas here. I need to see what this dungeon has in store for us. Oh, there's a river nearby too. I haven't seen one of these in a while. And again, I haven't been traveling much either. Start the lightning. And they're dead. Holy. 
That didn't take much. Uh, collect water. There. Any leeches in the water? Nope. Alright, whatever. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun. Uh, almost there. And I could probably her head to the herbalist house next when I get out of that dungeon. Let's see what we got in store. Actually, what's my electromancy power now with all this new mantle? Magic's 174. I lost some because of the mantle I replaced. But. Electromancy's at 56, holy. That's a big increase. Holy, Shock does 19 damage now. That thing used to do like 6 maybe in the beginning. It barely did anything. Now it's doing almost 20 damage. Oh, somebody's fighting a snake. Let's do this. A lightning strike. Did I just kill a bird? What the, <laughs> the lightning strike targeted the bird. Uh, rip the bird. May he live in peace now. All right, well that's a thing. I didn't know you can kill animals with it like that. Guess it's an easy way to kill a bunch of animals or birds. I guess. Is it? Let me see if it's roasted. Hold up. Let's see if it cooked itself. Oh, it's not. Pull up. Got chicken. I can use that. Huh, this spell might be good for like farming animals <laughs> that are like birds or little critters. Because it, it seems to insta kill them anyway, so it's not like they're gonna run away anymore. And the second you get close to a bird, they'll fly away. Nice, that leveled me up. 29 now, uh, one more and we're maxed out on willpower. Alright, we're gonna go this. And then we're gonna get this next. This will really increase my damage by a lot. And I don't have room for this. What is this? Sealer Reflection? It's probably on my next hot bar. Let's see how this works. What do I do? Do I pass it on myself? Animal abuse? Don't worry, they're digital animals. They're not real. Magic resistance, nature, physical, oh, physical resistance, damage reflection. I kind of want to test it out, but I don't see anything to test it out. Oh, this guy, fuck, I kind of use it though. Oh, he's running away, damn it. I can't, I can't just make him shoot spells at me. I wanted to see how, how it worked. Oh wait, actually maybe I can, hold up. Let's move away a little. Oh my God, he keeps running away like a pussy. Gosh damn it, I wanted to test out my new spell here. <laughs> I can taste my own spells, yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> Wait, why is that a thing? Why can't I cast it on enemies? Why is that even a thing? I don't understand. Who in the right man would cast it on an enemy? <laughs> Just to test it out, I guess, but I mean, even then. I don't see any practical purposes for it. All right. Nothing. Couple of cash. I might find an artifact in here, maybe. And if I do, I might have problems with the room. With the lightning strike. Holy shit, 126. I think crit it hard. It killed that necromancer or that mage man. Oh, monk. Nice. Get a silver ring. Nothing here. Oh, money. Alright, what's down here? Just a beefy boy. I can't get out.
All right. Uh, I don't think that's gonna kill him. Actually, you know what? Might as well use this. Oh, that's the good stuff, am I right? More XP. Give me everything. I got the drugs, I got it all. 25% more XP gains now. And what else do I get? Hunger resistance. Holy. Two more vision. 50% fatigue. Holy, that's a lot of fatigue resistance. Fumble chance, reduce, sanity, increase by temper 0.10 every turn. That's not bad. I'm gonna kill him with this. Holy shit, did that do 200? It did 234 damage, jeez. That is a big hitting spell. Not gonna lie. I have, oh, if I see a mage, I should use my spell of reflection, actually. There should be a couple of them in here. There's probably a mage boss, maybe? No, no, probably not. These uh, hidden dungeons usually don't have mage bosses. It's mostly uh, skeleton knights of some kind. They're really heavily armored. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Uh... Spell of Reflection. Whoops, did not mean to do that. Come on, cast a spell at me before it runs out. It reflected it, I think. Oh, it didn't. Yeah, there we go. Body aches. Now he has his own debuff on himself. <laughs> nice. And now he has the other debuff on himself. Holy curse. This guy is dead, man. I can't. Oh, I was able to reflect that if I had it longer. But the duration on that's not long. I can't see much very far with my drug effect on me. I got another one of these guys, huh? Nothing. I need some food actually. There we go. Uh, fudge. I need room. I might drop the chicken breast or the bird tender meat. <laughs> uh, since I don't think there's a campfire near here to cook it in. Alright. Uh, I don't think I need a spell reflect right now. I don't really care about the debuffs right now. Yeah, it didn't really matter. How much energy am I regening? Only six? Per turn? Or per, not turn, but... What is, like, six and two? What? It's being inconsistent. Why is it being inconsistent? Whatever, uh, I'll have to figure out another turn. Ooh. I can't really pick that up right now. Another one. More money, holy. And I still can't pick this one up. A thousand for that vase, holy sh... I better... Better make room somehow. There's just a couple of these guys. Maybe I should use Spell Reflection. That'll reflect any and all spells right now. Do 
Put the ball of lightning. I'm almost out of mana, holy. Actually, I did kind of run out. There, uh. Ah, oh, shit, I ate too much. Um. Take the potion, I'll take this so I can identify it. I don't need this, I don't know why I have that. Disenchantment? I probably won't need that. What's the potion, anyways? Life drain, okay. I should probably head down. I gotta fight the boss as quick as I can before the drug runs out. It won't be a while, but still. Guy's still not dead. <clears throat> I am running out of mana. Okay, there. They both died. I'm almost out here. Oops, and not I'm gonna pick any of that up. What is that? I can hardly see anything at this distance. Okay, dead rat. One beefy dude over there. Someone heard me from the other side. Gosh damn, so many things to lockpick. Definitely worth a lot of money. Fatigue resistance, interesting. Jeez, so much money in this damn dungeon. Coming out, I can't not go that way. Could be the way, but I don't want to risk it right now. That's a lot of traps and another dead end. Okay, maybe it was that way. It was, gosh damn it. I gotta go through that damn door. Yep, I knew it. Fuck. This guy's a little too close for my liking. Okay, there. Thank goodness for that spell. Way too many enemies in the front door. Pat was trying to open the door. Oh, there's the boss. That's definitely the boss. Fuck. I don't like his abilities right now. Oh, thank goodness. Holy, that would have been really bad if he actually got to me. 350! Oh my... 
Gosh, there's a lot on the bus. Alright, what were you hiding, man? What kind of loot you got? A purple helmet. Pig face basket. What the heck is this? I've never seen it. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, but baskinets or such visor uh, visors are novel to Aldor. Well, Armisif could have crafted it. Huh. I have so much money again. Gosh, damn it. Some mail gloves. The helmet, though, I'm have to take that. It's unique for sure, so I don't know where I'm gonna fit it though. Metallic blue stuff. Damn, that's so much good things. Oh no. I might have dropped something. The nugget's useless. Um, this is useless. I need it for the quest though. But I might have to. You're right. Okay, let's just drop it for now. I'll make up more room here. I'm curious what this has on it. I did leave it some scrolls, but I didn't bring any on me right now. Any scrolls on the floor left here? No, I don't think so. Oh my, what the hell? How did a ghost make me bleed? How is that possible? Tell me. How can a ghost make me bleed here? Ah, oh, mother... F Shit, this guy's tanky. Crap, crap. Why is he so tanky? Holy. What in the world is that skeleton or night ghost all about? Jeez. Use this on my head. There. Oh fuck, I accidentally moved up. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. What are you at? I could just use this actually. Like the thunder strike. Actually this is garbage. Amber isn't worth much in this game. That was my crowbar. Oh, I lost one already. I used so much that I broke one. Oh no. I'm down to one. Maybe that's a good thing? Nah, maybe not. Um, do I have room for anything or no? Can I pick this up? Oh, I can, okay. Here's what's on it. Uh, I've already... Tonight fully check everything in here. I think I left something behind. Oh yeah, it's just this garbage. My drugs are better right now. I'm almost gonna hit level 22. Let's go back upstairs. Thanks to this, I got a lot of XP gains. Holy. I never finished everything up here. Thing. Couple of cash. More. Yeah, that's a lot of money. <laughs> All right, what's left? Oh, there it is. Oh no, that's a disenchantment scroll. Oh, the vase. I forgot that vase is worth a lot. I better pick that up. Drink some water. What's well, not worth anything? Bandages, I guess, isn't worth much. Move that. 
Porcelain vase. Where did I leave that stupid scroll? In here, right? Yeah, here we go. Uh, it's not that great. It has shock damage in it. What the heck? Oh, yeah, that's right. Metallic staff has shock on it, right? I, I just realized this has shock on it, and these are the stats that the fire mage is using. That doesn't make sense. Why is a fire mage using this stuff? So I remember he dropped this and I didn't pick it up earlier. Shouldn't he have like a more related to his skills, I guess? But whatever, I suppose. This is melees will hit a bit more. Even though he's not supposed to melee that much. Put all the ball of lightning in there. Somehow he got through my ball of lightning, I don't know how. Oh shoot, that's a lot of them. A lot of spear dudes. Still alive, okay. Somehow you're living. I see a lot of enemies. I'm almost out of my drug. It's almost out. I'm gonna have aftermath after this. And it's not gonna be a good time. How much does this cost? You know I'm gonna use this. I might not have enough energy for this. Just standing there. Got a bit of this. What is that? A master crafted falcon. Wow. That is a really good one handed sword for anybody who's going swords. One handed specifically. That's not a bad one. It's really good damage. Holy 29. That's a good find, but I don't need it. Ah, jeez. Let me use a spell of it. Of seal reflection. Oh, missed. What? It ran out. What the heck? Uh, I still need identification. I'm use one on this. Of course, when I'm not paying attention, I get spammed by them. random magic spells. I don't think I need life train. Life train only works if I melee. Yeah, it only works if I melee them. It doesn't work any other way. It won't work if I spam spells at them. I'm about to run out. Oh, ah, uh, shh. Not another one of these guys. There, good riddance. Damn it, I don't have enough mana for ball of lightning. There we go. I'm out of mana. <laughs> there, finally. Oh, an emerald. 
What is with all this jewelry? Holy. I'm living it up with jewels. It's like I'm playing bejeweled. Uh. Huh. I need to drop something. How much is this worth? Uh, I'll keep it. Maybe there's something good in here. Just a boar pell and money. But I'm out of here. My my drug effects are run out now. Oh, I have, oh, yep, there it is. Aftermath. Negative 25 or 20 experience now. Minus vision, fumble chance, and morale decrease. Actually, that's not a bad. It's negative, actually. Everything else, or oh, the fumble chance actually. But everything else looks fine. More manageable. So like minus XP gains is gonna do anything in combat too much really. I'm just gonna wait for it to run out. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I'm out of here. We're already done with this place. No artifact, but I did find this helmet. Pretty neat. Now right, we're going to the herbalist house. I'm gonna see if I can save the game there. And there might be a backpack actually. I could probably use that. I might vomit actually. I don't know if I vomit with the aftermath effect. Hold on, let me eat this. My sanity's high, morale's at zero. I heard a bandit. My vision isn't that bright right now. Oh, I leveled up. Even though I had negative XP gains. Okay. Well, that's cool. I maxed out willpower. Let's go. Nothing left. It's maxed out. Level 20. We can finally get arcane lore. Watch this. Watch this. Um, okay. Our power is at 179. And I watch it when we put it on. I need to refresh it. 179 to 201%. Holy. That is a big increase. How much was that of an increase? Let's see. It's 120. 21% or 22%? Somewhere around there. Like 21%. That's a big magic increase. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that bear right now. Jeez, man. And we're still we still have more spells to learn too. We're not even maxed out that uh, arcane lore yet. We have one more electromancy left, which should boost another one percent, and then it should finish off the entirety of uh, electromancy. And then we have a couple more magic mastery spells left. Uh, what's this? Um, hmm. I think we might go with this one. This one looks useful for my ball of lightning. It increases the ball of lightning duration by how much? 20% more. That's probably like one turn now. 20% of... Uh, what's the duration? Uh, four turns? Yeah, it's probably not much. There it is. I see the herbalist house. You can see his little farm. Sometimes I find a backpack there. Usually. We'll see if I get lucky this time though. <coughs> Where is it? Oh, it's not an enemy. 38 on a crit. Oh my, wait a minute. That's a, it's a, it does 26 baseline. What the heck? That's kind of a lot. Oh, nice. And then mall. There, good riddance. Where is the herbalist house? I can't see anything. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. I think they added more herbs on his house. I don't remember this many. I bet he's dead. Yep, there he is. He's dead. But he has a backpack. Um, healer staff, some thyme. All right, I need to make room for something. Open. 
Put it in there. Here, here. There. Carry that. I can carry a bit more items now. <clears throat> Let's read it. Um, oh, they did update the book. Now they have the picture for it. Interesting, interesting. Red poppy. I'm gonna have to add in more herbs because there was something missing in the book. Thyme. Mine wart, red poppy, henbane, flea wart. Nope, they're still missing some herbs. These are the more beneficial ones, but I mean, they're still missing a couple more in there. Even though they added pictures to it. What the heck? What's a wolf doing out here? Alright, I just want to save the game. Yeah. That's actually a clamp over there. Maybe I can just save it over there. Let's see. <clears throat> oh my gosh, more wolves. I hear so many howls. Something must be fighting though if they're howling. Maybe you should undo that unless they're fighting. Thank goodness for this drinking horn. I still have a lot more water left because of it. If I had the water skin, I would have run up by now. <clears throat> Alright, camp's over here. Let's just go over here and save the game, and I think I'll call it there. Um, look, it's a place to stop. Level 20. We maxed out our willpower. We're almost ready for the troll fight. I just need a... Uh, my better equipment, and that's it. Let's lightning strike them. Nice. And we have another mage over here. Oh, he cleansed my thing, that bastard. Took off my buffs. That's all of them, I think, right? Oh, a brooch. Take that. Alright. Save the game. Okay, let me see something. I want to check something out here. Hold up. What happens if I do... This... This... And then this... And then wait here... How much do I get? Okay, that's maximum everything I can do. 250... Oh my god. Am I reading that right? 250% more magic power. Did I hit the cap? Is there a cap to magic power? Because I'm not sure if the numbers are right or not. I think there is. Because technically I was at 202% with my new passive. And now with this, it should increase it by 60, but it doesn't seem to go into 260. I think there is a cap to magic power. I don't think it goes higher than 250. I have a 46% chance to crit. How much does shock do now? 28. 58. That's my highest spell. 22. This one does 15 now per tick. How much electricity power or electromancer power do I have? 56 still. Unless I use a spell, then it should remove this. Actually, let's do that. Let me see. There we go. Yeah, there is a cap, see? Even though I removed it because this gave me more magic power, there's no more... There's no more increasing it. So there's no point in increasing magic power beyond 250. Huh. But I don't think I'm going to normally hit that without the seals. Yeah, without the seal, I'm not going to hit that. But with it... Huh. That kind of makes me think then, is it worth having magic power jewelry? Because clearly it's not going to boost it anymore. 
if I'm not using seal of power, it's not going to be a lot. If anything, I want to increase electromancy at this point. I want this number to go higher. Or my crit chance, too. I need maybe this increased as well. Alright, I guess now I know. Well, for those who are trying to max out their magic power, there's a cap to, let, uh, to inform everybody. I don't know if it's a bug or if they intended it to be capped at 250. They probably did since it, it should have gone higher than that. But yeah, alright guys, that'll be it. We find something new every day, don't we? Alright, confirm that there's a magic cap, so there's probably a physical damage cap too. Maybe. If there's a magic one. I'm assuming the other schools of magic too might have a cap as well. To how much you can increase it. I don't think you'll ever hit it. I think. I don't know. Anyways, um, thanks again for coming by, Snowman. Ivy, uh, some new people, Wazzy, Sav Moon. Uh, Weaven. That's about it who came new. Alright, thanks again to anyone who follows. Much appreciated. Uh, I don't know if I should change the titles for the series. Because it's all whatever I put my Twitch title at for my YouTube ones. So, it, it might be confusing on the title, but at least I numbered it. So, yeah. Thanks again, some man. <laughs> yeah, I titled it, so... Or, I mean, I numbered them. So now you know which part is which. For the series. Well, probably... Maybe fight the troll tomorrow, maybe. Oh. I'll see, I'm, I'm gonna try to get my Electromancer gear and that's it. Maybe get the last Electromancer spell. And then see where we can go from there. Because clearly we hit a cap already on damage. At this point all we need is just the gear. So we can uh, get more Electromancer power. That's all we need. We don't need any more magic power. At this point in the game. Anyways, uh, that's about it. Thanks again, guys. Come by. Uh, see you later, snowman. And hope you guys have a good one. I'll upload this part to you too, then. That's about it. Alright, peace.